they're going to take this hackathon idea and model and bring it into their own cities, into their own communities across the Middle East and North Africa, which means you're gonna get hundreds of ideas. And these are all opportunities and tools and tactics that we could then spread and amplify across the globe. My hope is I have a hundred ideas. And those hundred ideas, can we get 20 startup initiated from that? I think for me, that would be a success. I want um, the young females who are online to be safe enough to chase their dreams, to go learn artificial intelligence, machine learning, so many beautiful things that are happening out there. And I don't want this to hold them back because this negative thing can stay back and mar you from reaching your potential. Never stop dreaming and never stop doing what you want to do. If we all felt safer online, we will have more real tech content creator who are women. We will have content that's driven by empathy more than just facts. We will have content that is really addressed to the right people, including women, not excluding them. You know, I know that this is a hard challenge. I know we're not gonna be able to solve it overnight. But I'm also very optimistic in the sense that I believe in a world where we don't have to experience violence. Like I, I've existed in spaces where there has been pure joy, right? And I felt fully safe. And, I, and that feeling of being able to be fully myself in all parts of my identity is a small example of hope that that could exist because it does exist. This is about one, beginning to start to minimize that level of violence that exists but working towards that world where really there isn't violence that faces women online.